Hello friends, uh, Elder Leah Threet here. And Pastor Heather asked me to take a few minutes to talk about my pledging experience with Westminster. Um, I think for me, a very formative year in my pledging journey was about five years ago when I had pledged a certain amount of money based on my lifestyle and income at the time. Um, and then ended up unexpectedly having a bunch of setbacks over the course of one year. Um, that ultimately in, involved me getting divorced, having to sell my home, and pretty big financial changes. Um, and I felt very badly that I wasn't going to be able to meet the pledge goal I had set and was worried I would get a phone call about it or someone would mention it or ask me where the rest of the money was or, you know, kind of a lot of things that weren't super rational. Um, but... I really came to realize a pledge is an expression of faith. It's not a contract that someone's going to chase you down over or hold you to if things don't work out the way you hoped. Um, and I did what I could that year. And in the ensuing years, I've been able to do more and more again and get back to where I wanted to be um, with pledging. And honestly, I'm hoping next year to even make a little bit of a bolder statement and pledge a little bit more. Um, this is actually probably the first year that I was able to exceed my pledging goal, and um, I'm hoping to be able to do so again. But I think the grace that was shown to me by members of Westminster during that time, and just the gratitude of me doing whatever I could, has encouraged me to continue trying to prayerfully consider what I can do each year, doing my best to meet it, and giving joyfully of whatever I can do. And that's what we'd like to ask of you, too, as our brothers and sisters here at Westminster. Uh, thanks for prayerfully considering your pledge and your support of the church.